Hey friends, it's Little Miss Coupons. It's Wednesday, so it's hump day. I'm outside of Walmart. We're gonna go in, we're gonna do a Walmart haul. Um, I think I just have a midweek that is like $5 for 10 offers or something like that. So I do wanna complete that today. Um, I wanna try to fit in two Walmart hauls this week. We'll see how that goes. Flavor Wiki is bumping. So I'm going to see what I can grab from here and I might have to stop at Target or Wegmans on my way home to get the rest. We will see. Um, it is getting a little bit later on for me in the day, like it's 1140. I know it's not late, but for me, cause I gotta pick up my kids at three o'clock. Um, so I'm gonna try to get this done and get this video done for you guys. Um, I'm super excited as always to get in there and grab some deals. So if you are not subscribed, please subscribe. It is totally free. It's the easiest way to support somebody on YouTube. And I'm still striving to get to that 5,000 subscriber mark so I can give you guys a $50 gift card. Please tap the like button while you're at it. It's one little tap, also free, another super easy way to support people on YouTube. Um, leave me a comment down below letting me know if you're new, where you're from, so I can welcome you to the channel and see where you're from. I love to see that. Um, let me know what your favorite deal is that you see today, and if you plan on going to Walmart this week, anything, talk to me. I always, always answer. Um, make sure your notification bell is turned on so you are notified when I post and you don't miss out on any of these great deals. And thank you guys so, so much for choosing to watch another video of mine. I really appreciate you let's get inside and grab some deals as always I came to check out the clearance section and I found at least squat all the makeup that was over here is gone except for these and those are still seven dollars so I'm not those are not gonna be a money maker or anything um, but yeah I didn't really find much else I did see these sheet sets over here that are on sale for $15, and I did need a new sheet set for one of my beds, so I actually think I'm gonna grab one of these. But this isn't gonna be part of my haul. All right, so I'm starting off by picking up a Persil for $5.44. I'm gonna use this $2 paper coupon that expires on $3.10, and then we'll submit to Ibotta for $1.50 back. It's gonna make it just $1.94. This does say a limit of one coupon, um, one identical coupon per shopping trip. I was gonna just grab five, but I don't think they'll all work. So I am gonna try two and just see if maybe the register will take it. If it doesn't, then I just won't grab the other one. All right, I'm over in the Airwick. I grabbed one of these Airwick Vibrant two count refills. They are $6.98. I did just request a review on Ibotta because it does say the two count Vibrant refills are included for the $4 back, but I think since this is limited edition, they might just not have the barcode yet. Um, I'm still gonna get it because it does say the two count are included, any of them. Um, so we should get $4 back from Ibotta and then $4 back from Shopmium. So it'll make it a $1.02 moneymaker. All right, next I'm going to pick up a Glade. It's $2.28. I picked this kind. We're going to submit to Shop Mium for a dollar back and then my points for 170 points, which is a dollar oh six. It'll make it just 22 cents. So I have my other Ibotta account with me today, my other phone, um, and I have a bonus on there, $3 for six offers. So I'm going to try to complete both bonuses today. Um, so on my other account, I am going to grab the Febreze deal. I'm going to grab small spaces this time. Last time I grabbed the sprays, but I do need more of these. So I'm grabbing two of them at $3.24. That'll be $6.48. We'll get $3.30 back from Ibotta. That's going to make them $3.18 for two. Okay, so next thing I'm gonna pick up, I'm gonna grab two of these Snuggle dryer sheets, the 40 count for $1.97. Unfortunately, we don't have those $1 coupons anymore, but on Ibotta, we have 75 cents back up to five times. The reason I'm grabbing two is because on Shop Kick, we have 125 buy kicks and then five scan kicks. So it'll be like 52 cents back per box there. So it's gonna make them just 70 cents a box. So I'm maxing it out for shop kick and grabbing two. All right, next I'm also gonna pick up one of these snuggle softeners. They are $4.77. We are gonna get $1.50 back from Ibotta. And then on shop kick, we have 350 buy scans and or buy kicks and five scan kicks so we'll get a dollar 42 back from there so we'll get a total of 292 back it's gonna make it just a dollar 85 for one of these which i think is a fantastic price and um, we believe that is a limit of two also on shopkick and a limit of five on ibotta so if you wanted to do it more than once you could 
So I'm actually going to pick up another one of these for my other Ibotta account because I actually have $2 back on that Ibotta for the snuggle. Plus what I'll get back on Shopkick. It's going to make it just $1.37. I actually might just pick up two of them on that account because it's cheaper. I'm not sure. We'll see how many rebates I have at the end for each one if I can do that. If you wanted to pick up the scent boosters, you could pick up a max of two again um, for $5.97. Um, you'll get $2 back from Ibotta and then $380 buy and scan kicks from Shopkick. Um, it'll make one of them $2.45. So I'm passing on that one, but if you wanted to grab that, you could. So I'm also going to pick up one of these Suavitel Shed Shields. I'm going to do this on my other Ibotta because I haven't done this deal yet on that Ibotta. I have the $3.50 rebate, so if you haven't done this yet, this is a great deal to do. Um, we'll get $3.50 back from Ibotta, and then Swag Bucks has $2 back when you buy one. So we are going to get Five fifty back. It's gonna make it a dollar oh three money maker, which is an amazing deal. All right, I'm picking up some poise today. I'm gonna grab two of these for five ninety seven. So these two are gonna be eleven ninety four. We have a two dollar rebate on Ibotta. That's a limit of three, so we get four dollars back from Ibotta. Then I'm gonna submit to Shopium for five dollars back on two, and my points for eight hundred fifty points, which is five thirty four. We'll get fourteen thirty four back when they cost eleven ninety four. It's gonna make them a two dollar and forty cent money maker. I'm gonna just pick up two more for my other Ibotta account, and I'll submit to Swagbucks and my other Shopium. It'll make them a two oh six money maker. Okay, so to finish off my second Ibotta account so I can get the bonus, I'm going to pick up the Old Spice travel size. They're $1.97. I would grab the deodorants, but they're all gone because those would have been a little like a little money maker. So if you want to do that, I did show it in my last video. They're $1.47 each. I want to say that brings you to like $4.47. You submit to my bottom for $5 back on three. It makes three of them a $0.53 cent money maker. Um, or you can do it this way, like I'm going to do it. You grab three of these for $1.97, that's $5.91. Submit to Ibotta for $5 back on three. Makes them $0.91 cents for three or about $0.30 cents each. And then I'm just going to grab one of these Johnson's Travel Size Baby Lotions. They're two sixteen. dollars We'll submit to Ibotta for a dollar back. It's going to make it just $1.16. And that'll complete my second Ibotta because I only needed six rebates for $3. Um, so that one's done. I'm going to finish up my other one now so i pulled off a bunch of those peelies last time i was here for the new dove um hand wash so i am going to pick up one of these for 4.97 i will use a two dollar peely i'll show you that in a second then i'll submit to ibotta for two dollars back on one it's going to make it just 97 cents um and i'm only going to be three cents away from my bonus on fetch which totally stinks um, I was considering picking up two of them, but I don't know if I can use two of the peelies in the same transaction. So let me see. Okay, so this does say a limit of two identical coupons in the same shopping trip. So I'm actually going to pick up two for $4.97. The two of them are going to come to $9.94. I'm going to use two of these peelies that'll take $4 off and then I'll submit to Ibotta for $4 back because it's a limit of five. Um, so I'll take another $4 off. So we'll be down to $1.97. Then I will hit my... Um, bonus on fetch I'll get two dollars back or they'll bring us down to $1.94 I'm sorry I'll get two two thousand points back on fetch which is two dollars it'll make them a six cent money maker okay friends so I have a no, um, more redemptions left for that dove deal that's going on on fetch mine is for five thousand five hundred points back um, and for some reason it's saying I only need one more instead of two so this is actually gonna work out better than I thought I'm going to pick up one of the Dove Even Tones for $7.48. I'm going to use this $2 hang tag that I had in my coupon binder. Um, that'll bring it down to $5.48. We'll submit to Ibotta for $3 back, bring it down to $2.48, and then we'll get $5.50 back from Fetch. It's going to make it free in a $3.02 moneymaker. Okay, friends. So I decided that I am going to throw in another Dove deal on my other account because my other Fetch account, the stuff that I'm doing on the bottom of the cart, <laughs> has 6,000 points back when you buy two Dove products. So I'm gonna pick up the Dove Even Tone again and use another $2 hang tag. They are $7.48. Then I'll submit to Ibotta for the $3 back on this. So we'll be getting a total of $5 off of this. Then I'm gonna pick up this for $5.47. So this has 460 buy and scan kicks on Shopkick, which is $1.84. So 
for the two of these total me up to $12.95. We'll get $3 for my bottom, $2 for the coupon off, and then $1.84 from Shopkick, bringing it down to $6.11. And then we'll get 6,000 points from Fetch, which is six bucks. It's gonna make these two just 11 cents. Okay, so another deal I'm actually super excited about is the new Dove body wash that came out. I came up with a little dealio for it. Um, you're gonna have to pick up two and they're $9.97 each. So I'm just gonna go with two of these um, hydration boosts. I think I'm just gonna pick this deal up because why not? Um, they're gonna be $19.94. We're gonna submit to Ibotta for $4 back on each one. So we'll get $8 for Ibotta. Then we're gonna submit to my points for 850 points, which is $5.34 for buying two. And then we'll submit to Shop Meum for $4 off of one. That'll bring our cost down to just $2.60 for both or $1.30 each. There is two separate rebates on my points. There's the one that would match up with Shop Meum that'll give you like $4.27 back, or there's the one that you buy two for the 850 points so you want to make sure you do the 850 point one because you'll get more back i've never had luck on my points with both of them coming off um if they did that would be great it would be a money maker but i think to get these for a dollar 30 each is a fantastic price and i really want to try them out so only needed eight more rebates for my first my regular ibotta account and i do have eight here but that vibrant warmer i'm waiting for them to approve it so just to be on the safe side i'm going to grab one oikos like we've been grabbing mine are now a dollar 34 you get 50 cents for my bottle it's going to make it 84 cents i'm actually going to grab a fast switch again they are on rollback for a dollar 94 submit to shop me for a dollar fetch for a dollar for buying one or a thousand points and then swag bucks for a dollar it'll make it a dollar 06 money maker all right guys, so Flavor Wiki is bumping with granola bars, like I said. So I'm starting out that, there are so many I have to grab. The first one I'm grabbing is one of these Peanut Sweet and Salty Nut Nature Valley six count bars. They're $2.98. The reward on Flavor Wiki is $5.74. So it's gonna make them a $2.76 money maker. Okay, the next one I have for Nature Valley is the Savory Nut Crunch Everything Bagel. Again, they are $2.98. You get $5.74 back from Flavor Wiki. But I think since I'm buying <laughs> to Nature Valley um, products. I can then submit to Ibotta for another 50 cents back. So instead of being a $2.76 money maker, that'll make this a $4.26 money maker. Okay, next one I have on Flavor Wiki is this Made Good Chocolate Chip um, Granola Bars. They're $3.96. We'll get $6.74 back from Flavor Wiki. It's gonna make this one a $2.78 money maker. Same deal for this one, it's $3.96. We'll get $6.74 back, making it a $2.78 money maker. Next one up is the uh, Kodiak Crunchy Chocolate Chip. They're $4.96, we get $7.78 back, I think. It makes it a $2.78 money maker. Next one is the Sunbelt Bakery Chocolate Chip. Um, they're $3.82, you get $6.24 back, makes it a $2.42 money maker. Next, I'm grabbing the Kind um, Almond and Sea Salt. They're $7.48, you get $9.24 back. It makes it a $1.76 money maker. This one, it's the Kind Breakfast Almond Butter. They're $4.98, you get $15.24 back. It's gonna make this one a $10.96 money maker. Okay, so those are all the granola bars that I'm grabbing. Um, the other ones that I have on Flavor Wiki, either the store doesn't carry or the reward is less than, um, or the product costs more than the reward. So I'm gonna go check and see if they have any singles available because you can buy any count um, for these and it'll it'll work. So even if you bought one, it should still work because it says any count as long as it's the exact product. Um, I'm trying to think of what store it is that, oh, it's Tops. Tops has like boxes of these like open where you can just buy one, I think. So if they don't have them here, I may just end up trying Tops to see. Um, I don't know, we will see on my way home what I feel like doing. Um, I also think if they have the Reese's bars, I'm gonna grab them, so I don't wanna take forever getting home, but let's run over here, check out this last deal, and I'm gonna call it a day at Walmart today. So last thing I'm picking up today is the Reese's cones. They're $6.97. I'm gonna submit to Ibotta for $3 back, and then this will be the second time I'm picking them up, so I'll get a dollar bonus. And then I'll submit to Fetch for 1,500 points, which is $1.50. It's gonna make this box just $1.47. Let's go cash out and call it a day here. All right, guys, I am back home with this Walmart haul, 
and it turned out absolutely amazing. Everything on the table, it turned out to be completely free in a $29.60 moneymaker. I'm going to thank Flavor Wiki for that one. Um, I had three separate receipts because as I told you in the store, I was submitting to two separate Ibotas, two separate shop meams, two separate fetches. Um, so I separated my transactions out like that. And then one of them I did on Swagbucks and the other one I did for my points. Um... And then my last receipt was just all of the Flavor Wiki bars. I did those all together on the same receipt. Um, so my first receipt was for my main Ibotta account. My total on that receipt was $73.02. I ended up getting $14 back from Shopmium, $305 shop kicks. So that's $1.22. I got 1,870 points from my points, which is $11.76. 9,000 points from Fetch, so $9.00. Then on Ibotta, I got $27 plus a $5 bonus for my weekend warrior and then plus a dollar bonus for the Reese's. Then I did have to submit a ticket for the $4 back for the Vibrant Airwick refill. So um, that made, I ended up getting back $72.98. Like I said, we spent out $73.02. So that was a cost of just four cents. My second receipt was for my other phone for all those other accounts. My subtotal was $52.06. We got back $6 from Shopmium, 1,175 shop kicks for $4.70. We got back $8 on Swagbucks, $7 on Fetch for 7,000 points. I did have to correct my receipt because it never picks up the Dove Even Tone deodorants. Um, then I got back $23.80 on Ibotta plus a $3 bonus. So I ended up getting back $52.50. I made that receipt a $0.44 cent moneymaker. And then my last receipt was all of the um, granola bars. That came to $34.22 with tax still $34.22. Um, I will be getting back in total $63.42 from Flavor Wiki. So that made that a $29.20 moneymaker receipt. So altogether, everything was $29.60 moneymaker. That's absolutely amazing. I did not expect today to go that well. So I'm super, super happy. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video and I really hope you hop on Flavor Wiki and get in on some of those moneymaker granola bars because it's gonna be totally worth it. Um, if you are not subscribed though, please subscribe. I'm still shooting, like I said, to get to that 5,000 subscriber mark so I can give you guys a gift card. Make sure you tap the like button while you're at it. It really, really helps me out. It takes one little second and it's free. Leave me a comment down below if you would like. Let me know if you're new and let me know where you're from so I can welcome you to the channel. Make sure your notification bell is turned on so you are notified when I post. You don't miss out on any of these deals. And again, thank you so, so much for coming along with me today on our Walmart trip. I hope you enjoyed this video. Happy savings to everyone, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!